Hey guys and welcome to the future of Samsung. Today we'll be taking a look at the video hands-on of Samsung Galaxy Note slide and some bunch of other Galaxy products of the future that will soon be a part of Galaxy Z series. Quite possibly they might even be released in 2022. Forget the S22 for now, it's time to see the future. We even have our first sample from Samsung's 200 megapixel sensor. Now before I begin, this is very important for you guys to hear the WhatsApp scam on on YouTube is pissing me off. You may have seen these comments on my channel and on other creators as well. So if you see these bots account in the comment section with WhatsApp number, just report them immediately. Unfortunately, YouTube isn't doing anything about it. So just a big heads up. Okay, back to the video. We have our first working look at the Samsung Galaxy Note slide. This is a dream smartphone that seamlessly transformed itself into a tablet. Notice how in a smartphone form, it's like a traditional phone. You can even see Instagram looking pretty optimized. It's like a Galaxy S22 Ultra pretty much. And then with the press of a key, it becomes a tablet. The screen expands, giving you extra functionality without any crease that you may see on a foldable smartphone. This is like the best, most easy working of this concept by any brand. I really hope Samsung brings this slideable phone soon in the future. Next up, we have the Flex Note project. This is basically the foldable display tech coming to laptops and tablets. The most impressive is this foldable laptop with full screen. We literally saw this Samsung concept just a few months ago in a trailer video and now you can see the actual product working in real life. It's amazing how quickly Samsung is making innovation in this field. And honestly, this looks incredible. It gives you a 13 inch foldable screen. And when unfolded, it gives you a full on 17 inch display. Now next up, we have the Flex G and Flex S concepts. And these devices could be a part of Galaxy Fold innovation. We've got the Galaxy Fold S with a triple folding design. It's uh, basically Samsung's first ever product to have a outfolding and infolding display in one product looking pretty good multiple screens to play with and then we have a similar concept with the flex g as well now this is all pretty cool and if you look at all these products all of them are trying to give us a smartphone slash tablet combo and in my opinion the slidable node does that best without any crease and it's legit pretty cool like imagine a phone like s22 ultra that expands its 17 15 nits bright 120 years display into a tablet form that is so incredibly awesome but yeah let me know what you think about all of this in the comment section below. Also in the news, we have the first sample, and I mean the very first sample out of the 200 megapixel ISOCELL HP1 sensor. Samsung actually won an innovation award for the sensor, even though we haven't seen this inside a smartphone yet, but it's still getting pretty capable. It's got some powerful features like 8K video at 30 frames per second, super sharp photos. Next year, we will definitely see a 200 megapixel sensor on the Galaxy S23 Ultra. Now last but not the least, Samsung has unveiled a pretty cool projector that does incredible stuff and it's called Freestyle. This is a smart projector that can provide media experience at any angle. It works seamlessly with Samsung smartphones and Samsung smart TVs. In fact, it's got all the Samsung smart TV features built in and when you're not using it as a projector, it can give you smart view. Honestly, this looks pretty cool. It also looks very travel friendly. Let me know what you guys think in the comments comment section below. As for the release date, the freestyle will come to global markets in the following months. So that's all the latest news. Let me know what you think in the comment section below about all this new exciting future Galaxy products. For me, the most exciting one is definitely the Galaxy Note slide. Uh, but let me know what you think in the comments below. Be sure to subscribe for daily tech videos and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.